Today we're going to be taking a look at the best trailer hitch options for your 2010 Scion XB. Here on the top, we're going to have the Kurt part number 12490. Here on the bottom, we're going to have the draw tight part number 24815. Another thing to keep in mind with both of these hitches is the 2010 and 2011 release Series XB. These hitches will not work with those vehicles or that model. So just make sure you keep that in mind. Our Kurt here, you can see the cross tube is a lot thicker. It's going to be a lot more durable. It's also going to have a reinforced collar. It gives it a much cleaner look when it's under the vehicle. And the Kurt's also going to connect on three points on your frame rail. Draw tight is only going to have two connection points on each side. It's not going to have the reinforced collar. Cross tube is a lot smaller, so it's not going to be as durable. Now, that being said, the Kurt is going to be a class two, and the draw tight is only going to be a class one. Kurt's going to have a 350 pound max tongue weight, and that's the downward pressure on the inside of the receiver tube. And it's going to have a 3,500 pound max trailer weight, which is a trailer and load uh, together. As you draw tight, it's only going to have a 200 pound max tongue weight and a 2,000 pound max trailer weight. Another difference is with the Kurt having three points of contact, on the passenger side you will have to lower the exhaust. With the draw tight you won't have to do that. Another difference between these two is the Kurt is going to require the use of a stabilization strap for any non-wheel loads, as draw tight is not going to require that. Now that we've gone over some of the differences of these two hitches, let's go over some of the similarities. Both hitches are going to have a black powder coat finish, so they're going to resist any rust or corrosion. Both of them are going to sit back behind the bumper fascia. The only thing it's going to be showing is your receiver tube, so it's going to look very nice on the vehicle. Both are going to have a rolled steel safety chain uh, loops. Both are going to have a half inch hitch pinhole. Another similarity between these two hitches is they're going to come with all the necessary hardware to get them installed. They're going to mount directly to existing weld nuts in your frame rails and there's going to be no drilling or cutting required. So both of these hitches are going to be perfect options for your bike racks and cargo carriers, maybe light hauling smaller trailers. In summary, as far as weight capacity, I'm going to have to give it to the Kurt. As far as uh, looks, I'm going to also have to give that one to the Kurt. As far as ease of installation, only because with the Kurt you have to lower the exhaust a little bit, I'll have to give that to the draw tight. As far as my personal preference on what I would choose to put on my Scion, it probably have to be the Kurt. Gives me a little bit more weight capacity. Uh, I like the look. I like the reinforced collar, and I like how it attaches in three points. Yes, I had to lower the exhaust a little bit, but that's a minor, a minor thing to have to do. So I would have to go with the Kurt. That'll do it for a look at the best trailer hitch options for your Scion XB.